Hello, it's Hussain here. In this video, I want to share with you how to add text to your video and how to add an animated subscribe button in your video. Link for download shortcut in the description of this video. First, we're gonna add text. This is the shot that we want to add text on it. Click on it, go to filters, then hit the plus button. You can find text in video category or simply you can search text. We have different text here. I select simple. Then you can remove the code and type whatever you like. I type subscribe. Now you have the menu here to edit your text. You can change the preset slide right or left. I select slide in from left. You can pick whatever you like. You can adjust the size just by clicking on the corner and tracking. I want to be displaying here. You can change the color of your text by clicking in here and then pick your color also you can change the background by clicking in the background and also you can change your font too yeah that's all you need to know about text and now let's add an animated subscribe button in our video first we're gonna add a video track and then import my animated subscribe file I can say that you didn't need what you want to me then I just cut subscribe button part, then click in shot, go to filter, then hit the plus button and video category you can find chroma at once. I search chroma, then click on it and play it with these three icons. But if your background color is same as me, arrange like this. I can say that you didn't need what you want to me. Maybe I was wrong, even want wasn't anything. And then you can resize it or change the position where it should display. Click on the shot, go to filter, hit the plus button, and search here in the search bar size and click on size and position. You can adjust the size by click on the corner or you can change the position by dragging from the middle. Okay guys, that's it. You can export by click export button and then I'm gonna select this for YouTube. The resolution and spec ratio is right for me. You can change if you want to, but I suggest you, if you have no idea about this, leave it like this and hit the export file and select the folder and hit the save. And it's starting exporting right here. Okay guys, if you learned anything in this video, remember to leave a like and subscribe for updates. Thank you so much for watching. See you all in the next video.